Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. With the relaxed SOP, the first thing in our mind was to treat ourselves to a much needed vacation therapy. Since the state borders weren't open yet at the time, we could only book a hotel room in our city. And in this video, we are going for a little staycation at Escot Kuala Lumpur. Located in the Kuala Lumpur city centre, Escot Kuala Lumpur is a service residence in the vicinity of the Petronas Twin Towers. We've booked a two-bedroom executive apartment that comes with two bedrooms, two bathrooms, a kitchen, and a living area. For a two-night stay, we've paid a total of 918 ringgit that we've booked through Agoda. While there was a little wait during the check-in, we did get to enjoy the lobby area, which I think looks pretty cozy and welcoming. Now that we have checked in, let's show you the room. Welcome to our place. Let me bring you for a room tour. Over here is the dining area. The table's pretty huge and it can fit four people comfortably with a lot of dishes. And we bought ourselves some snacks. Look at the chips. Here has a big mirror. Check out some. And this is the living area. Nice and comfy. <laughs> this unit is perfect for four people because most of the things are in force. One of the best part is the balcony. From here, you can see part of the KL view, which is pretty nice. Pretty nice skirt. Now let's check out the room. Oh yeah, there's a huge TV here as well. Some cabinet here. So it comes with two rooms. This is the second bedroom. It comes with a twin bed, but they join it for us. There's also the closet here. And right in front of the bed is a TV for you to enjoy. It has a really nice view of KL as well. And this is where we can access the balcony. Now let's check out the bathroom. There is two bathrooms in this unit and both rooms come with a bathtub which is awesome. It comes with toiletries, some lotions. Now let's check out the master bedroom the master bedroom. It is much more spacious than the second bedroom. It comes with a king-size bed. All rooms come with a TV. So there's like three TVs here. Pretty people. And also, it has a balcony. It's awesome. Can they open? Can they open? Nope, it's locked. And this is the master bedroom toilet. It comes with two sink. It's a huge mirror. And this one comes with a shower. You need to put your dirty laundries. With a bathtub as well. This unit comes with a separate kitchen. It has all the plates, pots, pans, utensils, cutleries, everything ready for you. There's even a microwave, a built in hood and hob. You can do all your cooking, everything. And it comes with an espresso coffee machine. They've provided four capsules. Speaking of coffee machine, there's a Starbucks kiosk in the lobby where you can get your caffeine fixed. There's also a small convenience store next to the lobby area, or you could walk your way to Surya KLCC to go shopping or have a meal, which is exactly what we did. It took us about five minutes to walk from Escort to Surya KLCC. After we are done with our lunch and shopping, we came back to the apartment and went to hang out at the pool on the 22nd floor, which has an amazing view of the city. It is quite a nice, decent sized pool. Due to the COVID restrictions, the number of people allowed at the pool is still limited, so we had to make a reservation for the swimming slot during our check in. There are quite a number of deck chairs for you to relax around the pool or take a selfie. After our swim, we decided to cook ourselves dinner since we have a fully equipped kitchen. We've got ourselves some fresh goods earlier at the cold storage grocer in Surya KLCC. During the first night, we chose to stay in the apartment to spend our family time together and get to enjoy the view from our apartment. Nearby Escort KL, there are many rooftop bars around. So the next evening, we visited Vertigo, which is the highest rooftop bar in KL known for having this awesome view of the city. 
we have a separate video so you guys can go check it out. But if bar is not your thing, there are many restaurants and street food available around KL as well. Overall, it has been a wonderful stay at Escort KL. The unit is perfect for a small family and we definitely love the location. We hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel to see more of our Malaysia travel and food contents. And as always, thank you so much for watching. We'll see you in the next video. Bye guys!